the split-screen Morris Minor, a classic car and the first one owned by Leslie Grantham. But it wasn't straightforward, as he told the Motor Show. Right, okay right, then, Leslie. <laughs> split-screen Morris Minor. When was the last time you saw one? About 1963-64. Yeah. It's exactly the same, down to the <laughs> dreadful pit marks on the back. I know, it's a, got a bit of a yeah. pock marking, hasn't it? Yeah, it's not Was the yours same. this colour? Similar, I mean, they were all pretty icky, weren't they? Yeah, sort of grey, grey or grey. I think there was a lot yeah. left over from the war of paint, and Morris Minor, I think, <laughs> used it, you know. They did stop making submarines, they painted their cars with it. Yeah. It's cute, yeah. though, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Sound doubtful. No, no, you see it drive? now, it's dreadful. Let's have another drop. <laughs> It's a tight old squeeze, it's isn't it? How did anyone ever conceive any children in this? I don't know. Well, anyway, we won't go into that. So what's the story then, Leslie? Tell me about buying one of these. Four of us, we bought a car. We decided we were going to buy a car. What did you pay for the car? I think it was, it was either £28 or £26, £28 or £36 or something like that, but it worked out that I know I put £8 in and that was slightly less than everyone else. And we went off and did all the things that, you know, um, that guys did when they were 16 or 18 or, or what, and uh, uh, pitch black, driving back, and the driver stopped, you know, I said, OK, see you tomorrow, 10 o'clock, right, fine. <laughs> Leslie's place, you know. Went on a bit further, the next one got out, see you tomorrow, Leslie's place, 10 o'clock. I thought, oh, it's got nice, she's going to drop me home. Well, said, it's very nice, you know. A um, bit further, he pulled in, it's his place. And he suddenly got out and said, hey, it's the keys, he said, um, you take it home and we'll see you tomorrow at 10 at your place. And by the time it's all registered on me that I couldn't drive, he'd gone. <laughs> so I didn't want to lose face, so I sort of turned the key and made a terrible noise and crunched a bit, and, and I had to go four and a half miles. I think I did the first first 150 yards or 500 yards in reverse, because I couldn't get out of reverse. Yeah, so you weren't impressing the girls then in the moggy? No, no, I never impressed the girls. I, don't, I can't now, you know. That's the story of my life. I've always been unlucky. I had a rocking horse once it died. Oh, no. 